Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you guys how I do my everyday makeup. Um, it's pretty basic and pretty easy for the most part. Um, as for me, like I have a son who is a year and a half. So, you know, when he cries, mama has to go run to him. So I got to do my makeup pretty fast and easy and quick. Um, so yeah, but most of my makeup products, sorry guys, just getting a little bit comfortable here. Uh, most of my makeup products are from Target, believe it or not. No, this video is not sponsored. Um, but you know what? They have the same, to me personally, like their stuff is, is really, really good. Um, majority of my stuff is from there. You know, my highlight that I use, that I do get from Sephora. But other than that, my foundation, brushes, um, my powder, concealer, like everything is from Target. Which, I mean, I love Target just in general, so... Um, okay, so let's go ahead and get started. My face is already clean. I washed it. Um, just gonna go ahead and put these little clips here just to get it out of the way. I don't need one on this side. I'm, I'm actually pretty good. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I like to prime my face with the NYX Studio Perfect Photo Loving Primer. Um, it's really, really good. I like it. It goes on pretty smooth. Um, let's see. So I'm gonna put a little bit on. I'm gonna beat my face up with this. Do not mind the cars outside, guys. The outside noise. Bear with me. Ah! Just kidding. I'm trying to do home alone status, but not today, sis. All right. So I know a lot of people use beauty blenders. Oh my gosh! Please stop arguing outside traffic. Um. I know a lot of beauty uh, gurus. A lot of people that like to do makeup. They like to use a little. Um, uh, beauty blenders, but I for the life of me like I've tried it and I don't seem to like it when it comes to foundation So I like to use this little um, wedges here, which I absolutely love. I've been using it for like years now So okay, so after primer, I'm gonna go ahead and put on some foundation This foundation is I have a mirror right here guys um, This foundation is the oh My goodness Hello, the super stay full coverage. You know, mama's got to have full coverage Tate all her, to hide to hide all of her dark circles. You know, that's what kids do to you. Sleepless nights. But I'm not complaining cuz I love my children. All right. Oh, can you please hide nose ring? Thanks. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and go in like this. Pretty quick. I'm not moving so quick. I need to hurry up. I'm just kidding. I have all the time in the world for you guys. Actually, up until... I'm just kidding. All right. Oh, can you please get out of the way? Thank you. Like, I seriously look scary without makeup. Like, all of you guys are used to seeing me with makeup. But I literally look scary without it. Like, I scare myself sometimes when I look in the mirror and I'm like, ah, would that be dope? New face, who this? So, all right. Got these massive dark circles. They're it's like the black holes under my eyes. So yeah, I just like to kind of put it on. This lighting though, dang, I look like a ghost. Oh my goodness. And I literally have like no eyebrows no lashes like i swear when i was born somebody like snatched them from me like please come back i am your rightful owner so i have to put falsies on oh, which is fine i mean i would love to get eyelash extensions but i rub my face so much i touch my face so much that it just wouldn't work and it would just be like a waste of money i mean i wouldn't mind trying it you know just to kind of get a feel for it but I don't think it's something I can do all the time. So I just gotta blend the bottom here. So after we do foundation, we are going to use concealer. I like using this CoverGirl concealer. Works really, 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 really well. Uh, I just put it under my eyes. I like to use a lot, actually. So I'm gonna need to go get some more after this video. Hmm. All right, so now I'm just going to blend that in. 
so I'm not your you know I don't I feel like when I put makeup on it's not the correct way like the way everybody else does it but I just like to do it my way it works for me so it is what it is take it or leave it just kidding but yeah I like to do makeup in a very weird way as you can see I'm putting concealer like all over my eyes my eyebrows like I don't know it's just the way I've been doing it for such a long time now it's hard to break old habits okay now I'm gonna go ahead and use this finishing powder by NYX I love it I love it I love it so with this okay I will use a beauty blender for this part so I'm gonna go ahead and just oops sorry cameras with me put it under my eyes again because I need those eyes to pop out be like bam okay you know you look alive today oh thanks okay now after that i like to put powder on and this is the unix mineral matte finishing powder which i also love and now i'm going to just get my brush my good old brush and just go over it I know this is so weird like on the way I do makeup but ew like I am disgusting just kidding as you can see I'm doing it pretty quick I'm used to like doing my makeup pretty quick except when it comes to weekends because that's when like dad's home and he's able to watch um our son so I have more time to do that this is just like an everyday hey we on the go let's roll because the baby's crying gotta go to his appointments or wherever he needs to go because I have no life he's my life and yeah actually no all my kids are my life I should say but he's the one with like more doctor appointments because he's so little so yeah just gotta hurry up and go just get up and go all right so after that is done we are going to start the eyebrows. I know, people start with eyebrows and the foundation, but I'm like the complete opposite. I'm weird, I know. Okay, so now we are going to start the eyebrows. Okay, so the eyebrows are like the most complicated for me because either one, they both come out right or one comes out bad. Like, it's just, it's, it's just weird. So I'm going to move my mirror a little bit forward. There you go. So you guys can take a look. so when it comes to eyebrows i'm just like again like week weekday eyebrows are like always looking ratch but come weekend like that's when they're like oh i'm bad today i'm bad but no weekday weekday eyebrows are just gonna remain ratch until skyline grows up and drives himself to wherever he needs to go but that's not for like a while so i gotta say with weekday ratch eyebrows but it's okay it's okay all right all right so that looks pretty decent now we are going to do the other side i just gotta line them up i know the way i do my eyebrows is like pretty weird why am I like leaning? Ew. I have like problems. I'm just kidding. Alright. So. So eyebrows are like so tricky. Like you think you mastered them. But once you're like. Doing it. And then you see the final look. You're like ew. I have to go back and like. Redo it or wash it off. Like whatever the case may be. But eyebrows are like I think take me the longest when they really shouldn't i mean i've been doing this for like a long time now but every day they come out like different is that weird <laughs> like this one comes out better sometimes this one comes out better or they're both just sucky oh, do not look at my nose ring guys i like always try to tuck that in people think i'm picking my nose but i'm not i'm like just moving my ring like pushing it in like just hiding it like putting it back where it belongs all right so apparently this right eyebrow is not going to cooperate for you guys and i'm sorry there's not much i can do for you guys but i try to beat it around 
but it's gonna have to remain like looking uneven if I cannot get it right within the next like 20 seconds good enough for you guys like you guys are so picky just kidding okay I want to try to darken this one a little bit and normally when I do my makeup like my ratchet weekday makeup like it usually takes me like I don't know maybe 20 20 yeah like about 20 25 minutes to do I mean I don't do anything crazy to my face but come Saturday oh. <laughs> all the palettes come out all the palettes but only this time like I'm only pulling out one I might do another video like just do like my my weekend like pappin makeup routine okay so we got the eyebrows done next we are going to do shadow Eyeshadow, eyeshadow, eyeshadow. Sounds French. Eyeshadow, eyeshadow, eyeshadow. Okay, like, where is my brush? Skyland, did you take my brush and put it like in Play Doh or something? It's so, like some Randall brush, but whatever. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and put a little bit of highlight. I know see again this is weird like I know you guys don't normally do this but I like my whole eye to like pop out not literally because that would be weird but like makeup wise okay so I'm gonna go ahead and do the same on this side I know I can't just complete one eye and then do the other like once I do like this or one thing to one eye I must immediately do it to the other like it's just weird OCD weird okay so now that I did that I am gonna go ahead and blend it so you don't have those harsh lines okay so now I'm gonna go in with a deeper color. Well, not deeper, but like, what is up with my hair? But like more of a like natural, like nude color. So this is gonna be like super, super natural. Like you wanna go out and be like, look, I'm not like really looking dead, but I did what I could, sorry people. That's what you want to tell the world when you go out looking like this. Oh my goodness. Get it together, brush. Get it together. Okay, so once again, once I got that color in, I'm going to go ahead and you can hardly see it. It's like not even there. Like, I don't even know what I'm blending in. Just kidding, it's there. Okay. So, once that is in, I'm going to go ahead and go with a darker color, a somewhat darker color, and just put it on the corners of the eyes. On the outer corner, I should say, not the corner, because that would like look like I got beat up or something. But, I'm going to go ahead and put it right here. And then I'm going to put it like a, on the crease, cut crease, crease cut. Crispy fries. Oh, I'm hungry now. I'm gonna go ahead and like do that, whatever that means. And then I'm gonna do the same on the other side. I feel like I have more light on this side than this side, which is gonna be weird, like the final look, because this side's gonna look a lot like darker, because I feel like there's nothing going on this side. Okay. So once I have that down, I'm going to go ahead and, you guessed it, I'm going to go ahead and blend it out. Blend, blend, blend. Put your finger on your pen. Alright. <laughs> Same to this side. Blend, blend, blend. Put your finger on Ben. Who's Ben? I have no idea. 
Okay. So once that is nicely blended, let me see, what am I looking for? Oh, here it is. I'm just gonna use my brush to like shoo away all the excess shadow that may have fallen. So when it comes to this, I'd have to be super careful because of my nose ring. One time I like, like, you know, brushed out my face and I was like so careless that I pulled it out. Like the bristles, like literally like pulled it out and it hurt so bad. I think it was like a week after I got it pierced. It hurt so bad. Like I freaked out. I didn't know what to do. Um, I went to the bathroom. I put some like, I drenched it in alcohol, like rubbing alcohol and i washed my hands and i forcefully like pushed it back in i thought i was gonna get like a keloid or something i was so scared uh but no nothing happened no keloid just some blood and a panic attack a mini heart attack but that's all but all is well now i can't wait to change it i want like a diamond like this one i guess you have to leave it in for like six months for it to fully heal or something i don't know but I got like four more months left. Ooh, cannot wait for that. All right, we are done with the shadow. Now I am gonna do some, I'm gonna put some liner above my, well, not above my eye, like on my lash line. Cause when I put my lashes on, I kind of like it to look like darker right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in with that as soon as I find my eyeliner, here it is. Okay, so I have liner on top of my eyes. Now after that, I am going to go ahead and put some highlight right here in the corner of my eye. I'm gonna go ahead and put lashes on. So I like using the Ardell uh, Wispies the Studio Effects. I have the lashes right here, but this is it. I like them because they're natural, like throughout the day, like, you know, like scaring people with like your night lashes. So I like using these. And the thing about lashes, when I get them, I have to cut them because I have really small eyes. So thanks, mom and dad. So that's something else that I have to do, added to my list of things to do, is to cut my lashes. Ow. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put some glue on my lashes. This is a duo glue. I like to do bird calling. They all fly to me when I do that. Just kidding. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and place this on my eye. Okay, one lash down another one to go i like lashes i love lashes only because i don't have them but well it is what it is okay so one down i have another one to go all right Okay, so now that we have both lashes on, um, I'm gonna go ahead and contour my nose. Okay, person with alarm, shut it off. All right, so I'm gonna go in just like this. All right, so now I am going to Make those lines somewhat disappear. Okay. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and put highlight on my nose, on my cheeks, where it needs to be. All right, as soon as I find my little brushy brush. All right, you're going to have to do. Oh, ew, no. Here, got it. All right. I don't know if you guys can see, it's like super light on your end. Okay, almost done with the nose. With the nosy nose. Okay. 
All right, so once that is done, now I'm gonna do my cheeks. Do not mind these faces that I'm making. I know you guys make some crazy faces too. Other side. And the thing about this palette that I have, it's the Anastasia. Did I show you guys that already? Well, if you don't, now you know. The Sugar Kit. Um, I like to blend the colors. I also have the Sun Dip one, which I also like to use. And I like using a lot of highlight. I don't know. I like it a lot. All right, so I'm gonna go with the butterscotch color to go somewhat on the bottom like that. Again, this is like quick, quick and easy, ratchet and easy, but it's all good. After that, I'm going to go in with my different Anastasia, the Sun Dipped one. And I'm going to use like the bronzer and just put it on the bottom. Can you see that? I feel like for you guys, I have to put like a lot more. It looks a lot lighter on camera than in person. So my son's probably going to get scared. I'm thinking I'm looking like a clown or something. Okay, other side, we are almost done. A little bit more. Let's see even out this side. Just a little bit. Okay, so after we do that now guys, I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this brush. It has a little bit of my powder in it. I'm just gonna kind of go over it to kind of like blend it. All right, after that, we are going to do lips. L lips. All right. I don't know about you guys, but I always have to put like chapstick on like before I do anything to my lips. Like, otherwise, it just feels weird and gross and dry. Disgusting. Ugh. All right, so we are going to go in. Where is that lipstick at? Ew. Ew. Alright, so now I'm going to go in with the NYX Powder Puff Libby. I like NYX, as you guys can already tell. I'm just going to do a little bit. I don't want anything too, like, too crazy. Okay, so once that is done, I'm going to go ahead and put some gloss over it. Because I like to shine bright. Just kidding, I don't. Actually, I do. Alright. All right, guys. So now it just leaves us a hair, which I'm about to take this little clippy off. Fix it up a little bit. Ew, my hair like feels disgusting. All right. Oh, a little itch on my nose. Okay. All right, guys. So this is the finished product. Super simple, easy, maybe took me like, I don't know, like 15, 20 minutes. Just depending, I don't know. I really don't know to be honest. I have to go back and check the video. But yeah, this is it. Um, I hope you guys like it, I hope you guys enjoy it. And um, any other videos, guys, let me know in the comments down below. Um, I think I might do like my Saturday, like Sunday makeup. It's like a lot more than this. So yeah, I think it came out pretty good. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are not yet subscribed, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and make sure you guys turn on your post notifications. And also guys, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at BeckyLive double underscore. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!